Well, turning our attention back to those big changes coming to Southwest Airlines, you know, we want to get more perspective on what these changes mean for travelers and Southwest Dallas based employees. So we are joined by Mike Boyd, who is an aviation expert with Boyd Group International Aviation Forecasting. Thank you so much for joining us, Mr. Boyd. My honor. Thank you. Well, you know, we want to get right into it. Our first question, these big changes, Southwest has just announced them. Is this a surprise or were these changes inevitable? No, it's inevitable. Look, it's not that big a change. Most of us aren't going to really notice it. And again, it, what they're saying is you can now select a seat ahead of time rather than when you get on the airplane, look around and find the only middle seats left. So it's, it's, it's moving in the right direction. There's no question about it. And I think the way Southwest has always handled things, it'll be done very well not going to change a whole lot of anything. It's just probably going to be, uh, offer consumers a little more choice at Southwest and the good Southwest will continue. Now, recently, for those who don't know, Elliott Investment Management bought a nearly $2 billion stake in Southwest. So is this the result of that? No, I doubt it. That, that, that Elliott um, purchase and that Elliott proposal was quite frankly laughable. You know, MBAs that don't know anything about the airline business trying to tell Southwest how to do it right. So that's not the reason. I mean, you got Bob Jordan there. They know what they're doing. Uh, they're going to move the airline ahead. Uh, and this latest move clearly shows they're, as typical, they care about the customer. And one more question for you. You know, you say this is not going to be something that a lot of people notice, but there are people on social media who are wondering if this is the first step of, of anything else. Could there be more changes that the airline makes? Could they start charging for checked bags? I, I would hope they wouldn't. I mean, uh, Southwest has been very, very much ahead of the curb. There are people like me that fly Southwest because of that. There are people like me that fly Southwest because they didn't have silly change fees. There are people like me that flew Southwest because, quite frankly, I got treated like a human. So uh, I don't think they're going to change a lot more things. They're going to try to make it easier for the customer. And the seat, aside, the seat selection thing is one of those. All right, Mr. Boyd, thank you so much for your time. My pleasure.